Okay guys, this is Education Moron here. Um, this has been one that has been requested. Um, I'm going to try and do this. Um, I've done it before. It is kind of a pain in the butt. Um, this is not a Comcast sensor. But it is the only sensor that I can show you how to do this with. Um, the process is still the same. So <clears throat> your Comcast sensor should come apart and on the inside you'll see that there's a spot for the battery which should look like this and in the inside there should be a little button. Okay so now this application is for when your sensors were previously synced to another touchscreen and you want to use them on a new touchscreen. Um, <clears throat> this may take a couple times to get it right, um, which is no big deal. Um, hopefully you guys can get it to work. Unfortunately, I cannot show you um, with real sensors, uh, and that is because I can't delete any of my sensors on my current system. Um, I believe I made a video of that explaining um, that whole scenario to you guys a couple weeks ago. Uh, so anyways, I'm going to do my best to show you this here. So what you're going to do is you're going to press and hold this button inside your sensor, okay? And then you're going to insert the battery while holding the button. You'll see that the light comes on and then it flashes 